In this week's Piano Drop, we'll be featuring the subtly rhythmic Ulfrith synth by Akos, percussion box and cymbal effects by Andy Stroud, On the Telly by Brendan Bonsack, Bathroom Door by Martin Russ, and Synth Cader by Andy Myers. Alfreth synth by Akos. Alfreth means textures. To me, textures mean stillness in movement, sequence in tranquility. I started planning my album around this concept a few years ago, but always got stuck on the sound design. This is meant to be a portable toolkit to experiment with, hence the very minimally recorded oscillators and the amp section. On the right side of the GUI you'll find swelling pads and percussive delayed rhythms. For the best effect, use the layer samples without the core oscillators with the zero millisecond attack on the amp, add an arp. Percussion Box and Cymbal Effects by Andy Stroud The idea behind this library was to record sounds that would work well in both orchestral and pop settings. As a drummer and percussionist, I really enjoy incorporating little flourishes with shakers, tambourines and cymbals, as I believe it can add some very interesting texture to a track. These flourishes quickly became the main focus of this library along with some accented hits. I recorded studio shakers, small egg shakers and some seed shakers. For the cymbals I recorded a range of dark sounding Zildjian K dry ride cymbals and some brighter sounding minor crashes amongst others. On the Telly by Brendan Bonsack. A 1960s Telecaster electric guitar with built in tremolo and simple legato via key switches. This is one not for the shredder. Think more mellow and spacious. Use the mod wheel to reveal reverse and delay effects beneath the notes. The settings tab allows adjustment of delay and saturation parameters. Bathroom Door by Martin Ross The mechanism in the door handle to the bathroom has a squeaky spring in it. It really needs oiling, but it's one of those jobs that never seems to get high enough on the priority list. So it makes this weird scraping sound every time you open the door. It turns out that it scrapes with a perfect C2. So here's a very processed version that ends up as an unsettling pad sound. From left to right, the microphones start out with tone and get noisier and grittier to the right, with the actual door sample providing the clicks in the middle. This is not a bathroom in which you want to spend much time. Synth Cada by Andy Myers. Every 17 years, the brood X cicadas emerge from their long slumber. They climb out of the ground, shed their shells, grow wings, and take to the skies. 
few days later, the chorus of cicadas begins. There is no sound quite like it at all. This instrument is comprised of four different patches of sampled cicadas, a lead, bass, an arp, and a robotic sounding cicada. Since we only get to experience this once every four years, I wanted to try and capture it and do something fun with it. 